Well, we just saw what the ocean has done to the Jersey Shore, but in the West, after four years of drought, El Nino has kicked in with crushing waves and pounding rains that have left homeowners on the edge. Here's John Blackstone. As the cliffs in Pacifica, California collapse dramatically into the ocean, an apartment building teetering on the edge comes closer to falling in as well. For residents still living in the building, the sea view from their balconies now presents more danger than beauty. We heard a boom, boom. And I'm like, what the hell is that? As right as we're walking out the door. In his apartment, Michael McHenry was packed to leave at short notice. I can't continue to have a professional work life and social life as well as not know that I'm when I come home, my property is going to be there. Yeah, there's just nowhere to live. The order to go came this afternoon with notices going up that the building is unsafe. Monica Montoya has to be out by tonight. We have no clue where we're going to go. How long have you been here? Uh, two months. I just moved in. Just. I just got my place. Finally got my housing. Just moved in. Now I got to move out. El Nino powered storms with high surf and heavy rains have been destructive along much of the California coast this year. But nowhere has the damage been more threatening than in Pacifica. I love it here. This has been my dream all my life to live by the ocean, like right by it. Pacifica has seen it all before. In 1998, the last time major El Nino storms hit California, the bluffs here eroded so quickly, residents fled before one home tumbled into the ocean. Other houses were knocked down before they too fell off the cliff. In 2010, two of the apartment buildings on the bluff were evacuated and condemned. The building condemned today seemed safer until the cliff again began falling away. The powerful winter storms that have been hitting California are predicted to continue into March. That's good news for easing the drought, Scott, but bad news for places like Pacifica, threatened by coastal erosion. John Blackstone reporting. John, thank you.